Well, good evening to you and welcome on this most perfect evening for a game of football to which we look forward immensely. It's hardly a surprise that everybody has come here in their droves, this being a fixture that has received so much coverage in the days leading up to it. And it's good to see that we have a good contingent of visiting fans by the look of it too. The atmosphere is amicable, the conditions do bring out the best in everyone, and I think we're all looking forward to a feel-good game. And expectations are rising, and decibel levels are rising. The noise is quite something. You can feel what football means to the people in this part of the world. Well, a system promoted by the rise of total football, Peter. The wider players in the front three are, are key operators in how it all works on and off the ball. They have to provide for the central striker, of course, and protect their fullbacks, so they'll get few breathers. If these two don't make a good impression, there are quite good replacements on the bench. Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Well, this fellow, Mignon, we all remember him, Peter, from his stint in his native France. That time he, he took an unfancied side to the title against all the odds. I think he had 21 clean sheets that year, which is over half the games, and proof that goalkeepers can make a real difference. Well, quite no argument for me on that one. Borichot. That's nice. Tomori can get it clear. Luffy. What a letdown when you've got such presence and movement. Crazy. Now Pulisic. Chukwese. That is good strength. Final ball not quite right, and his teammates are irritated at that. Shifted upfield. Hernandez. Tomori gently done. And if anyone is going to break the deadlock, now would be a good time. That is lovely. Rafael up to meet it. She's needed a better contact. Well, this is simple. The supply is to be admired. The defending is to be admonished. Luffy. Out for a throw. Hernandez. And here's Shoe. There's the hit! And the first 45 minutes are up. 
But it has been a half largely of could haves and should haves. Perhaps the more impatient amongst the supporters will feel their overture a goal. But it's certainly not for the want of trying, so nothing to show as yet. At the break, it's nil-nil. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, they look lost for ideas and, and lacking in talent, which all contributes to a, a chronic case of impotence. Well, after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. Already up and running for the second half. Well, that first 45 minutes didn't deliver as we'd hoped. Lots of effort, but a lack of quality with the finishing has left us hoping that someone could step up and produce something a little more magical. Chukwese. Calabria. That's an excellent interception. And the counter is on. Omari. Very few chances to talk of, Jim. Defence is, it seems, on top here. Yes, nil-nil and little promise of a goal due to the shot-shy nature of this contest, but I'm not giving up on it. There's plenty of energy on the pitch not to give up hope just yet. Pulisic hops for safety. And Hernandez. And Benacer. Pulisic. He is just caressing the ball. Oh, good ball. Chukwiza! No mistake! Look, before we can even delve into the detail, the significance of taking the lead should be our initial reflection, and that's priceless. Yeah, to see it unfold as succinctly as that, it, it looks telepathic. Milan draw first blood here. Look, I just think they've kept at it and got their reward. Now they need to hang on to it. Truffer. Terrier. Oh, it's come loose. Swung over into the middle. Really gets it back. He can get that clear. I thought it was going to happen then. How many more chances can they realistically expect now? Tomori. And that's that. 